Greetings, madam. Uh, please pardon my evening intrusion, but I am peddling a product guaranteed to change your life. Uh, what if I told you I could offer you a solution to any of your problems? Oh, oh, no need to respond. I can see exactly what you're looking for. J just allow me to show you what we have to offer. Uh, you can't come in. I don't even know who you are. <laughs> of course. Where are my manners? I'm John T. Zitterman. I I'm a salesman of sorts. <sighs> I, I know, I know, salesman it has such a negative connotation, doesn't it? But I assure you, I'm no ordinary salesman. I can offer you a very unique service that I think you could benefit from. Uh, I'm not interested. Oh, but I think you are. I, you want to be rich? I can have you sailing across the Mediterranean Sea in, in mere minutes, sipping champagne, eating caviar, anything you like. I don't want to be rich, I just want you to leave. I don't want to be rich, but that's the American dream, isn't it? I can see it in your eyes. You want to see the world, don't you? I can have you on the most beautiful beach in Hawaii. Sand between your toes, the ocean tide kissing your feet. Like, like on the postcard, the images you see on a postcard. Look, I don't know who you are or what you're selling, but I am not interested. Mom! Love. Love is what you're looking for. I, I, I can't believe I didn't see it before. Uh, listen, sweetheart, I can transport you to the finest restaurant with, a, with the handsomest man. Uh, he can be strong, intelligent, muscular, sense of humor to boot, brown hair, blonde hair, any color eyes you like. I, I don't understand. How can you do all of this? Fulfill any fantasy? I... Technology. It can do extraordinary things. My name's Jessica. Technology, my dear Jessica, can do extraordinary things. I like to consider myself a projectionist. Like, at the movie theater? Not that type of projectionist. I'm not projecting images onto a silver screen. I'm projecting ideas, hopes, events, straight into your mind. So you're crazy? Uh, far from it, actually. It's quite simple. I'm essentially putting you into a dream that you can control. I'll be offering a helping hand with several small devices, and you, more specifically your brain, will fill in the rest. There are some minor limitations, I want to but... see my boyfriend again. He was killed. You mentioned limitations? They're nothing to worry about. It's, it's just the time of the projection is limited. That's all. Nothing good can last forever, right? And Let's get this set up so we can see for yourself how it works. Okay, the projection is ready, my dear Jessica. Remember, you have 30 minutes. Yes, I remember. Uh, 30 minutes or my brain gets scrambled or something. Well, your brain may begin to lose sight what is real and what is not. Stay in too long and, well, there isn't really anything to worry about. I've programmed a watch into the projection. It'll beep when time is up. And just turn the watch off to wake up from the projection. I must stress the fact I can't wake you myself from out here for it'll cause further complications. It is up to you to wake yourself up from the projection. Do you, do you understand? Yes. Okay, let's get started. Just take these and we'll begin. You weren't coming out until after dinner was cold. Oh, I was so afraid I'd never see you again. Never see me again? What's come over you, Jess? Did you have a bad dream? 
the worst dream ever. It's okay. I'm here. I'm not planning on going anywhere anytime soon. I'll join you. Tonight, please. Okay. What's that sound? Oh, no, not yet. I didn't know you had a watch. Are you planning something? It's new. Well, are you gonna turn it off? Uh, I think it's broken. Uh, yeah, I'll fix that for you. I've got it. up. Of course, where are my manners? My name is John T. Zinnerman. I'm a salesman of sorts. I warned you. Who the hell are you? Jess, who is this guy? I'm a salesman of sorts. You get the hell out of my house. No, no, not yet. Not yet. Yes, we may have another one. It's the second one today. She doesn't get out soon. I just had the worst dream ever. Promise you'll never leave me? 